I get messages on Instagram asking about supplements all the time. Are supplements worth taking? Are they worth the money? If so, which ones? And I absolutely hate the response from people saying you don't need supplements if you get eight hours of sleep and eat enough protein and calories in your diet. That's super annoying and honestly, I think it's obnoxious. I do take some supplements and I am sponsored by Legion. All the supplements that I do take come from Legion and there's four supplements that I do take on a regular basis and you can use the discount code Haas for 20% off on the Legion website. Yes, I do get a commission from them so it does help out a ton when people use it. The first supplement that I'm going to talk about is magnesium. With this stuff, I wouldn't say I've really noticed an improvement in sleep quality. Still wake up and toss and turn a little bit in the middle of the night, but it's definitely helped me fall asleep at a more consistent time. But magnesium has made a big difference for me ever since having a baby daughter. Since taking the magnesium supplement, it's just been a lot more consistent. And despite me making fun of creatine a lot, I do take a creatine supplement. This is what I take right here. It's called Recharge from Legion. I don't have much to say about it, but the creatine from Legion has some pretty good flavors. A lot better than the flavorless creatine that most other brands sell. This one is strawberry lemonade. Having a flavor just makes it easier to take on a consistent basis. Also take a protein powder. I have the chocolate right here and the cookies and cream right here. Many people will say you don't need a protein supplement if you get enough meat or eggs and cheese and milk in your diet, which may be true. But I like having a protein shake early in the morning as my breakfast because it's a lot easier and more convenient than cooking eggs, especially since I'm up at 5 a.m. four to five days a week. This stuff from Legion just contains all the standard ingredients that most other protein brands are gonna contain. But the flavors are good, the chocolate's good, cookies and cream is good, the salted caramel's good. So I usually start my day with a protein shake. I'll probably have one some other time throughout the day when it's convenient. And then the last supplement that I take is just a green supplement. It's huge for me because I don't eat vegetables except for potatoes if you want to call those vegetables. So this is how I get my daily serving in. Usually just mix this in with my protein shake or sometimes my creatine drink. So if you're like me and you don't eat vegetables or you don't feel like you get enough vegetables in, I think a green supplement is huge. But those are the supplements that I take on a regular basis. If anyone has any other questions regarding supplements, feel free to message me on Instagram. I'm a pretty open book about it, but that's all I have for the video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.